I'm in Becky's homestead kitchen today, but today I'm going to be doing a taste test on eggs. Stay tuned, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Welcome back to Pine Meadows Hobby Farm. I'm your host, Jerry Hansen. That's right, I am in Becky's Homestead Kitchen because Becky is my wife and this is her kitchen. She's allowing me to demonstrate a taste test of eggs. Today I collected eggs and we've got three types of eggs. We've got a farm-raised, free-range chicken egg. We've got a duck egg and we've got a goose egg that we're going to be cooking up and doing a taste test and I'm going to see how they stand up. So let's get started. Get the flame on. Get my cast iron cookware in. The flame. Cast iron is the best cookware in my personal opinion to cook with. This farm fresh chicken egg I believe is going to be a little bit predictable with its cooking and its uh, flavor. Now you can tell this is a farm fresh egg because look how that yolk stands up. Uh, store bought eggs the yolk will flatten out a bit because it's an old uh, dehydrated egg. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't like runny yolks. I like my yolks to be well cooked and the egg to be more like a tire patch than uh, just a runny, uncooked egg. So we're going to make sure this is cooked all the way and then we'll set it aside and we'll cook the duck egg and then the goose egg. Now, this is how I like my eggs. So we'll set that aside right there. Now we'll take the duck egg. Now, this albumin is a little bit thicker. Oh, this is a fresh egg. Look how well that stands up. The albumin is really thick. That's really indicative of a fresh shade with that yolk standing up. Uh, one thing about duck eggs is they have a little bit tougher texture than the chicken egg but they're uh, still great for baking and eating. Some people prefer duck eggs over chicken eggs. And yet some people have allergies to chicken eggs and they can only eat a duck egg, so that gives them the advantage to be able to do um, baking. Um, which reminds me, when I was in college a couple of years ago, I was taking art class and I had one of my fellow art students she was allergic to chicken eggs and she found out I had ducks so I offered her duck eggs at no cost so long as she made me a goodie because she was a pastry chef and she came through with for me she took those eggs oh she was in heaven absolute heaven so she was able to finally make some pastries and eat them and not get sick she took those pastries and uh, brought them and we were able to taste test them and I was able to tell her what kind of ducks she can get for her backyard that are prolific egg layers. So I suggested uh, either a um, Indian runner or a um, khaki Campbell, uh, preferably a khaki Campbell, because those ducks are really good prolific egg layers. Time to flip this. Oh, look how that stands up. And make sure my yolk is broke. Now I've had duck egg before and they, they are delicious. Actually personally I prefer a duck egg over a chicken egg and I'll tell you when I do the taste test in a moment why I prefer the duck egg over the chicken egg. So this duck egg is just about done. I'm going to go ahead and set it aside and then now we'll do the goose egg. I 
have a feeling this goose egg is going to be two meals. Okay, as tough as a duck egg. As expected, look at the size of that yolk. Holy moly, it's huge. Confession time, I've never eaten a goose egg before. So I'm doing this exclusively for my YouTube viewers. I know what some of you may be thinking. That's way too much cholesterol. Perhaps, but it's, is it a good kind of cholesterol? Or is it a bad kind of cholesterol? Uh, you know, the medical reports and studies uh, come out about every year going back and forth with cholesterol and they're finding there's good cholesterol and they're finding there's bad cholesterol and they find chicken eggs are good eggs are bad eggs are good eggs are bad the consensus right now is eggs are okay uh yeah so depending on who's doing the study and how much uh they're putting into the study and if they're looking at just cholesterol yeah but keep this in mind your body needs cholesterol because that's what coats the little um, uh, neurons in your brain to keep it from short circuiting. So your, your body naturally needs some cholesterol. Our ancestors have been eating cholesterol and eggs and uh, well, we exist today because of it. Just saying, time to turn this. This is a big egg, huge. So as it's done as I want it to be, so let's go do a taste test. Now let's give you my true honest opinion. Let's try the chicken egg first. Try the yolk. It's predictable, you know, it tastes like a farm fresh chicken egg, which are, by the way, absolutely delicious. And let's try the white. Mm-hmm. Now this is what I'm talking about when I mentioned earlier in the show when I was uh, cooking it. The, the one thing about chicken eggs is uh, in the whites, you'll notice a little bit of a sulfuric taste to the yolks. And that's what these chicken eggs have. So let's go to the duck egg. Try the little bit of the yolk. Oh, the yolk has a lot more flavor than the chicken egg yolk. And uh, that's just my opinion. It's got really good flavor. Now let's try the white. Okay, the duck egg white is absent of that sulfuric taste. The, um, it also has a little bit more firmness to it. Some of you may not like the firmness, but it, you know, it's chewable, it's edible, and it's uh, actually delicious. It's more pleasant to me than the chicken egg is. So let's try the goose egg. This is my first time trying a goose egg. So let's get a piece of this yolk. Okay, that has almost the same kind of flavor as the duck egg. Um, I'm actually enjoying it. So let's try the white now. Hmm. No sulfuric aftertaste and it's not as firm as the duck egg would be. And it makes a meal in <laughs> of itself because it's so large. Um, yeah, as far as the three eggs go, my opinion is uh, the goose egg beats out the other two. My second favorite is the duck egg and my third favorite, of course, is the chicken egg. Um, perhaps maybe later we'll do a turkey egg. <laughs> Stay tuned for that video. 
Alrighty then, that is the taste test on the three types of eggs I raise here on the farm, uh, excluding the uh, turkey eggs. I'm your host Jerry Hansen, this is Pine Meadows Hobby Farm. I want to thank you guys for showing up and enjoying this little bit of a breakfast with me. A uh, taste test on the various different eggs we have. Uh, you can subscribe, leave a comment, give me a thumbs up. Sharing my videos really helps out the channel. Also, uh, clicking that bell icon down below alerts you to new videos as I upload them. You can also follow us on social media. I'm on Twitter, Facebook, Pinterest, Reddit, Google+, and Blogger. I will see you guys in more videos. Bye-bye.